First steps here from new GCS. We have reached the sixth week in our series of autopilot precision. In this series, we compare popular drone autopilots by flying them in a simple photogrammetry mission created in the new GCS and analyzing the results. So far, we have tested the following drones DJI Phantom 4, DJI NASA MV2, Microcopter Quad XL, DJI A2, and PX4. In this week's video, we will analyze the performance of DJI Phantom 3 for stop and turn and adaptive bank turn trajectories. We will use Google Earth for analyzing the flight trajectory. This is the original route imported into Google Earth. And now let's take a look at the stop and turn trajectory of the DJI Phantom 3. As you can see right from the start, the results are very good. The flight trajectory of DJI Phantom 3 corresponds to the test route almost exactly. The drone only slightly diverges from the route when cornering, but this pattern is consistent in all corners and is quite similar to what we saw in the Phantom 4 flights. When looking at the altitude of the flight, it corresponds almost exactly to the test route. Very good performance from the DJI Phantom 3. Next, let's see the adaptive bank turn trajectory. Similarly, as for the stop and turn flight trajectory, you can see that the Phantom 3 had no problem sticking to the survey lines. Cornering is very precise as well. Corners are rounded off just like they should be in the adaptive bank turn trajectory. Altitude wise, again, very good results. Phantom 3 had no problems maintaining the altitude set in UGCS. Overall, the flight results of Phantom 3 are very good and almost identical to the ones we saw from Phantom 4. Despite the fact that Phantom 3 is an older platform, if good flight precision and photogrammetry missions is what you're after, it is just as good of a choice as the newer Phantom 4. And that is all for this week's video. The links for the KML files from the flights can be found in the video description below. If you are interested in seeing any of the previous videos in the series, they can be found on our YouTube channel UGCS TV, as well as on our website, the link is in the description. Thank you for watching, make sure to subscribe to our channel, follow us on social media, and see you in the next week's video.